Hello everyone, welcome to my channel and in this video I want you to, to demonstrate the new remote control that I am wrote uh, using the uh, ROS uh, Java. Uh, ROS is a robot operation system. It uh, contains a lot of interesting features and one of them is a uh, uh, supporting of Java. Uh, and this allows to write uh, uh, such applications um, like remote control that will be run on the Android phone or tablet. And uh, uh, ROS itself contains uh, a very powerful communication protocol that's running on uh, TCP IP. And one of the great features is that it allows to uh, translate the images from uh, camera to the any nodes. For example, uh, I have wrote the remote control that gets the camera as it uh, plugged to the robot uh, uh, on the app and uh, I can see what uh, robot what a robot camera ca currently can see. And uh, it's a uh, very cool very cool feature. Another interesting feature is that it can be run, the ROS node can be run on different devices. And for example, I will run uh, two remote controls, one on that tablet and another on the phone. And both of them will translate uh, the images to the display. So I see the camera on this control and on this control also. Uh, so I can see the output from robot camera on both remote controls. Both remote controls show the information not only from the camera, but also the telemetry information. For example, the uh, temperature of the servo motors. So I, I see it here and on tablet also. Another interesting feature of new remote control is that it's running on the phone. But phone itself contains a lot of sensors that can be used uh, for controlling the robot. And one of, of the sensors that I am using this control is the accelerometer or IMU and let me show how I will use it for control the robot. To activate the accelerometer control I have to press the IMU checkbox on the remote control and now robot will try to uh, reflect the position on the phone in the space. When I rotate the phone, robot also rotates when I rotate phone in this direction, robot also rotates in this direction. And or, uh, the rotation also uh, is uh, applying during robot movement. Now I will demonstrate how the combinations of the IMU and the remote control can be used to uh, create new interesting moves.
uh, currently some movements not so smooth but I'm working on it and uh, will fix it in next version. So that's all for this video. Thank you for watching and bye.